I don't understand, you know, the enthusiasm, okay, that people have for XRP. No offense, I just don't get it. Okay, XRP sucks. <laughs> Listen, you know, sometimes in life, a lot of people don't want to face what's called the harsh reality. Okay, XRP is at 62 cents. That's it. Okay, whatever grandeur and delusions that you have, you got to probably get over it now. It when Bitcoin had its run, it didn't follow it. It doesn't follow Bitcoin. It you know, there's just nothing good about it. I'm sorry. Like, what is good about it? It wins the SEC friggin' lawsuit. It doesn't go up or goes up a little 10 cents then it drops back down again. It's completely a pump and effing dump. Lou continuously tells... See, one thing I have to say about Lou, he's a good storyteller. This is what it is with Lou. I give him credit. I been. I used to call him Walt Disney Lou. I came up with that. I came up with a lot of names for Lou. I came up with Uncle Festa. I came up with Mr. Clean, right? But <laughs> J. Lou, Tyrone and Jamal's boy toy. You know, I came up with a lot of names, but I also came up with Walt Disney Lou because he's a great storyteller. The, the guy used to do the same thing with AMC. You know, listen, you know, whenever Grande goes into bankruptcy, you know, my inside connections, you know, they tell me that's going to start the Moaz. That's going... Remember the tensions between Russia and Ukraine, and that's going to start the Moaz. When Elon Musk, you know, has to sell his Tesla shares for tax purposes... That's going to cause the Moaz. Market crash, that's going to cause the Moaz. Higher interest rates, inflation, that's going to cause the Moaz. Lou's got so many effing stories, and he's trying now to do the same exact effing shit with XRP. But this is the bottom line. XRP, if I had to come up with one word, she. <laughs> And, you know, I feel bad for people. People are basing their Christmas. They're like, who needs Christmas when we got XRP? Like that guy, Krabby, I'm reading his comments. These people really believe in this shit. Rod V, you know. It's been a long time since I had money. It used to make me feel so good. But I put it all in XRP. My wallet's empty and my life's not good. Yet, mother effer. Yet. New York Angelo. So I just don't know what to tell you people. You know, you should get some eggnog, juice it up with the good shit, drink it because get some friggin' uh, cappuccino, put some Sambuca in it. Wake those effing brain cells up because Lou, as you know, he doesn't really have too many brain cells left that are working. <laughs> and I think by listening to Lou, your brain cells are getting affected. XRP, one word. She. This video is not financial advice. I'm not a financial planner. I am the world's greatest entertainer that ever lived on planet Earth. The one, the only, a father in the house, baby. Wow!